It's been so cool to see your murals pop up all over the city. They get Laker fans fired up. LA sports fans are now, you know, traveling to your murals to take photos. What does it mean to you to be so uh, entwined with the fabric of the sports scene here in the city now? It's really cool. I mean, growing up, uh, I grew up in LA, so it, it was always, you know, you're a Laker fan, you're a Dodger fan. So uh, as I was getting older, uh, it really became a, a part of my everyday life. Uh, you know, hey, what's the Dodgers score? Hey, what's the Lakers score? So when I started painting, uh, it kind of just ended up on canvases and, you know, then walls. Uh, to, so to see people actually you know, respond the way they do to my pieces. I get some really good, like, messages that I've inspired people. I can't really explain the feeling. It, it's it's good. It, it feels it feels like I'm on the right path in life. You've been putting up murals of different Laker players for a number of years, but now I was reading that you're actually working with the Lakers for the first time. So they they reached out to me and uh, we we created this piece. Um, of course, we wanted to celebrate the Lakers getting into the playoffs, and we also wanted to just pay homage to everything that's been going on. Uh, you know, the healthcare workers, uh, a lot of the protesters, and just people being vocal about what's actually going on and, you know, trying to raise awareness. And, you know, I, I thought it was a, a piece to be bigger than the Lakers, be and, and something that represents Los Angeles, because Los Angeles, I feel like, has a lot of pride. You put up murals that feature athletes and broadcasters from all the sports, but the Laker murals are the ones that really grab a hold of the culture. What is it about Laker Nation, Laker fans, you think that have them gravitating so strongly to your pieces? I think it's just the passion behind it, man. Uh, you know, people are so passionate about the Lakers and I feel like it's just a, uh, such a high energy um, that I feel and uh, putting it on the wall, I, you know, fans feel the same way. I knew it was a Laker town, but you know, once those murals go up and the response I get, purple and gold runs through our veins, man. <laughs> Would it be challenging for you as a Laker fan to have to put up a championship mural for the LA Clippers? I mean, I wouldn't, <laughs> to be honest, yeah. I mean, there's, there's no hate That's there. how you know you're a real fan, yeah. I like it. <laughs> yeah, there, there's no hate there, man. Uh, you know, everybody knows who runs LA and that's the Lakers, so. It's like the little brother, you know, you want to cheer him on, you know, He's, hey man, you give him a pat on the shoulder. So many local sports legends, obviously. Yeah. And, you know, you, you, you've done a wonderful job immortalizing the legend Kobe Bryant. Talk to me about what it means to you as an artist now when you paint a Kobe mural. I would imagine it takes on a, a different meaning and significance to you. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I've been painting Kobe since I, I started painting. He, he's just been a huge inspiration to me. And, you know, at, at first it, it was a little, I was a little hesitant uh, on doing Kobe stuff just because, you know, everything that went on, I, it just, it felt different. It felt different for sure. But, you know, I, I noticed what it can do for the healing process and, and for fans. It was a real difficult time for a lot of people. And I feel like I hit that little slump for a bit and kind of Mamba mentality set in and got to get back on the grind. And, you know, that's, that's what Kobe would have wanted. And, you know, I, I feel like, uh, you know, you got to pay the homage. <laughs> you did a wonderful job with the Vin Scully mural out in Venice. You've done great Laker murals all over the city. Los Angeles wants to know, when are you blessing us with the Jim Hill mural? Oh man, that, that'd be a good one. Yeah. I mean, we, we got, we got a lot of, a lot of people we need to represent out there. That's for sure.